Since the coalition government took office, the Ministry of Public Infrastructure has laid out a grand plan for improving the way people travel within the region. New roads, bridges, pedestrian overpasses, and highway expansion projects were among them. While the pedestrian overpasses are complete, construction on the vehicle overpass that was planned for the entrance of Diamond Housing Scheme had to be canceled. According to Public Infrastructure Minister David Patterson, the government reserve where the road would have ran was sold to a private individual during the previous administration. Following this discovery, the Ministry of Public Infrastructure entered into negotiations with Demerara Distillery Limited. After months of talks, Minister Patterson was happy to say that the meetings were fruitful. In a Facebook post over the weekend, Minister Patterson explained what has transpired, saying, quote, with the help and cooperation of DDL, a true giant of a Guyanese company, we were able to access lands for a car park, market, and a second entrance to Diamond. Phase 1, out to tender now, is for the construction of a market and taxi stand. Phase 2, coming soon, is the extension of the road to First Avenue and beyond. Phase 3, to be tendered third quarter 2019, is for the extension of the existing roads to the East Coast, East Bank bypass. Initial blueprints and aerial photos show that the space between Diamond DDL Distillery and the Guy Oil Station on the public road will be earmarked for the project. Channel 2 Headline News, George Gonzalez. Thanks for watching Headline News. Leave a like or a comment below. And for updates on the latest news happening in Guyana, click the subscribe button.